this next video, we're going to talk about adding narration. So right here, I go to my media and I click narrate. This is me talking into my computer and giving a voiceover for maybe this girl. So I just hit record and then I count down three, two, one, and then I start to record. This part in the book, they talk about all of these different things, and I am just so excited to share with you. Then you hit stop and you can re-listen to your recording. You can record again, or you can click save. Once you click save, it's gonna save your recording onto your timeline. And you can see right here, I now have a new track and it's called voiceover. So again, I have a new timeline and it's called voiceover. And again, I can move that along my um, area. It's gonna play right here at about four this seconds. This part in the book, they talk about all of And then I can hear my voice. If I need to delete, I just click on it and hit the backspace on my keyboard. So again, I can click it and I can delete it and re-record or I can move it around wherever I might need it. It has to stay on an audio track. That's why this is red for on the video track. So make sure you're on the audio track or timeline.